Question, what's your favorite thing about Luke and Dan? Oh, is this to me? I think so. My favorite thing... Did you really curate a question asking my favorite thing about you? Apparently, apparently it's... I love it's, your dry wit and your uncanny uh, willingness to do whatever the f*** you damn well please. <laughs> there. Yeah, get owned. It's addressed to all of us, so I think Dan has to also say what his favorite thing about <laughs> Luke and Dan is. Yeah, I don't even want to know mine. Just, just what's your favorite thing about you? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I've never been. I've never had to think about this before. <laughs> wow, this is getting like deep talk now. What's your favorite thing about yourself? Yeah. Yeah. You can find something. I believe my ability to be interested in anything. That's cool. That's a good mm. one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's lame, but whatever. Wholesome. That's good. Okay, so yeah. hold on. I got to do Luke now. Mm -hmm. Oh, boy. Um, I was hoping we were going to dodge this bullet. My f Yeah, I saw how you tried to redirect <laughs> that, but I was right there with you. I think my favorite thing about Luke is how oh boy. we either mind meld <laughs> or... <laughs> or completely disagree we're, we're and still division. we still manage to make it work yeah that's what that's what gives us the dynamic that you guys like so much i think is we'll go yeah 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 yes no wait <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> i mean we saw it we saw it today right like it's um i my my the people i tend to be most successful surrounding myself with are the ones that um generally are aligned with me but when we're not aligned make me better and so that's if if i was going to give you if i was going to give you a one line how to pick an so um your bff you know a business partner someone that you're in it with for the long haul that's got to be it i had a i had a i had a conversation with someone recently about how they they work with their with their partner and but it's not it's not their workplace they don't own it they're just oh, they both, just both work at they're the same both place. employees at the same place that's scary and one of them uh this is the this is a, a male female relationship yeah i'm talking to the male in this relationship yeah. the male in this relationship is in a leadership role higher they don't directly report to each other, though. No. Okay. But but the org chart. If you're in a meeting, is the this person is above, and would would be placed in a situation at times, where like if that person is super derailed or off topic or talking about whatever, they have to get them back on board. Mm. Complicated. <laughs> And I, I, I brought up, I was like, you know, the, I feel like you should try to dodge it in every which way you can. And Linus and I are not in a romantic relationship, but I have never found a situation where I've been in this type of role where I've been able to be like really good bros with someone and it's worked before, right. especially with someone else who will also enthusiastically defend their position because i do that uh yeah and when two people do that it's not super common that you can avoid bad conflict yeah good and conflict I've, is okay yeah i feel like we've done a pretty good job of that yeah and that's cool but it helps that we're mostly aligned yes so we don't have to have conversations like well how, how are we going to run a forum without uh you know, uh, s s sound high volume sound ads, ads that, like, all fall over around the screen. Try to dodge your mouse and yeah. all this type of stuff. Yeah. Um, so we we don't we don't we we have maybe okay maybe maybe instead of just alignment maybe I should have said similar principles would have been a good way to kind of phrase that. Mm -hmm. But it's 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 definitely it takes tending. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you guys got to witness it today. Yeah, yeah, because you have to. You can't go to bed angry, right? Like, yeah. it's you got to uh, resolve it at some point. It's tough, and sometimes the resolution is, you know what? You're a lot more passionate about this than I am. Um, I guess we're gonna need to back down, uh, or I'll need to back down. And sometimes the resolution is, 
Um, I actually just really do need you to understand my point here. <laughs> you need to shut the f*** up for a second. <laughs> and sometimes it's in between, right? Yeah. yeah. But you got to figure it out. I mean, Yvonne and I have had some, some really tough conversations. I mean, especially, man, the stakes of everything are so low once you're raising kids together. Mm. Everything else is just like, eh. it's like, what's work? It's like, what, money? Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, money matters, especially when you've got 100 plus mouths to feed. If we don't make money, what's Dan going to eat? <laughs> right? So the, the stakes are, are, are really high. But with a child, the stakes are exponentially higher. Oh, yeah. It's their future. It's the future of everyone they ever interact with. If you, if you, if you are willing to sort of put that burden on yourself, right? It's That's the future lot, of, yeah. it's the future of their spouse, their, their kids, their kids, kids, right? Like it's their life success. Yeah. And their life success as, as, as small or as great as it might be could impact the world, right? Like there's the, the stakes are, are so high. Um, and so it's just like when we're making decisions about how to parent, Ooh. those are way more intense conversations yeah. than how are we going to organize this department for best efficiency? Here's my idea. Here's your idea. We disagree. You know what? Who the f cares? Let's try yours. And if it doesn't work, f it. we'll try the other one because f like whatever. Yeah. You know, because at the end of the day, it's all solvable, right? It's all it, 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 what we make a little more money or we make a little less money Ugh. observe performance potentially pivot yeah whereas like with kids well you get one shot yeah and there's certain actions that you can do that might not seem like that big of a deal but even if done once will like never be forgotten and yada yada, yada you can yada, traumatize yada. a living being and there's no like if that person deeply disagrees with your action they so much resentment can blossom out of that scene. And you're you're always their dad. She's always their mom. So like yep. they can't just like quit and go to another company and not care. Stakes are real high. Stakes are real there's high. A, there's a form of that, obviously, but there's I mean, like Yeah, the emancipation or whatever it's called. Yeah, like there's there's things that you can do, but there's no, some amount emancipation? of emancipation. I don't know. Emancipation is where you're like unhealthy, I think. You just run away. Um, and I think emancipation, yeah. But like that's not easy, and that's yeah, potentially emotionally damaging, and all yeah, that type sure. of stuff. Like it's, it's just very, and it could be worse than it was, you know. Yeah. Yep. 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 Mystical and float plane chat. My kids are basically loving and very feral. How do I fix? Um, well, usually when I want to fix a feral creature, I go to the vet. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> we can move on. Speaking of ways to affect their lives. Next. Okay. Uh, do you think that the size of LTT is damaging to smaller tech channels? Some smaller tech channels have expressed in the past that they aren't doing very well and that it's hard to compete with LTT. Sorry? I, I think I would have to wager with how algorithmic stuff works. Hey, wait, hold on a second. No, we got to back up for a second. Luke dodged answering about himself. What? I don't think so. Thank you, chat. You didn't say your favorite thing about you. Oh, boy. Thanks, chat. It's hard, isn't it? <laughs> Hold and, on, I'm going to switch over to Luke Cam here. Why? I don't know. And you thought this was a bad question. I don't know. I feel like all the things that I like about myself have very intense downsides. <laughs> like, I like that I go hard, but then I take a long time to recover. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like... <laughs> <laughs> Actually, though, like they, they all have super big. I like negatives. that I'm really loyal, but sometimes I do things that are kind of dumb and not in my own best interest. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, if it if it helps at all, Luke, the answer that I gave is also incredibly damaging every single day. <laughs> uh, I think it's probably the second one Linus mentioned. Uh, I, I I like that I stick with people and ideas, but. That can also suck a lot. <laughs> like, uh, going back, going way back, you should not have stuck with the NCIX 
no. tech tips paradigm. No. That was actually stupid. Yeah. Like you had so much potential. I can see why your parents were mad. Oh, yeah. You had all this potential, like super bright future. And you were wasting your time falling asleep behind the camera at some tech store with this like guy who's not even very senior at the company or anything. Just like, what are you even what are you even doing, son? I had, I had job offers that were twice as much as the starting wage um, at, at this company, let alone. Yeah. Let alone NCX. Um, but that was yeah, that was I don't know. But I like that. And look, I'm happy with how that resulted. So, like, I don't know. So he learned nothing. <laughs> I'll f***ing do it again. Yeah. That, okay, that line right there is also a big part of me. I don't, which which sometimes is great. And other times it's terrible. I don't know. A, all, a lot of... <laughs> I Have you ever done those, like, personality test things? Mm, uh, probably at some point, not recently. Though. I rank like 99th or 0th percentile in everything. <laughs> <laughs> no half measures <laughs> leave. <It's> like, <laughs> I've even had other people take the test as if they were me. Yeah. Because I'm like, am I just like skewing this or whatever? And yeah. they're like, whoa, <laughs> it ended up on like the far reaches of every category. And I'm like, cool. I don't know how comfortable I am with this. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I don't know. There's, I don't, I don't, there's things I think of positively about myself, but all of those things have downsides and I'm just, I'm okay with it at this point. It's fine. <laughs> I'm over it.